What I saw with the eBay presentation today was a phenomenal use of analytics. It's so nice to see a company that not only has the data, but uses it, gets the analytics, has people that understand the analytics, and they are so way ahead of everybody else. It was just truly incredible. I was, I'm still stunned, and uh, I, it is a sense of awe to see how technology is being deployed by eBay, and I never had realized that eBay was really a technology-driven company to this extent. It was absolutely mind-blowing, I thought. The whole growth strategy of eBay from the beginning to where they are today, how they got from a very structured environment to a much more analytic environment by using analytics against analytics to grow. It was very impressive to see that and the numbers that they have portrayed is amazing. It's very hard to pick out one thing that impacted me the most, but if I have to say, I had no idea that eBay was a company that ran on analytics to the extent that they do. They provide a ton of data to essentially everyone in the organization and they have such an analytical culture. Some of the things I've heard Oliver speak before and some of the things are natural extensions of fundamental concepts, but there's something that really, really kind of blew, blew me off at least is things that they're doing with what they call SQL++. That's something crazy. It's that they're able to achieve the results that they're achieving and the things they're doing, I mean, executing the functions on the fly, creating the views on the fly, and being basically how they're dealing with unstructured data, creating the structures on the fly, and being able to get results out of it all in a matter of seconds. One of the most fascinating things is that eBay has so much data and so much so much data coming into their system that they can't predict what they're going to look at. So they build for the unknown. They, they allow their customers to search on anything, which is really, really unique in the industry.